Welcome to Electronics Explained, where we talk about electronics for everyone. Today we are going to look at a measure resistor. So last time we talked about resistors and its main function, limiting current. And today we are going to look at how we can measure current using a resistor. So we all know how a multimeter has a current function. But what if I told you that it actually uses a resistor to calculate the current. So I've got a board over here where I can show you. Um, here we see the, uh, a multimeter board and this little metal um, part here, this one, it is a 0 0.1 ohm resistor and what it does is the voltage over that resistor is measured and the, um, the processor calculates um, the current using Ohm's law. Now for the bigger currents, uh, up to uh, 10 amps, it uses this, um, this bigger resistor. So again, for the uh, power rating, which we talked about last time, because you can't use a very small resistor for this, because, um, because or else too much heat will be generated and you will burn your resistor that's why it's very very thick resistor okay now that's out of the way I'm going to show you how you can do this manually so I built this little uh, test setup here it again it uses the 330 ohms uh, and LED which we calculated in previous video and we have a 10 ohm resistor right here the 10 ohm resistor is um, the measurement resistor. Normally you want to go as low as possible, but for a uh, video it doesn't really matter and I don't have anything lower than 10 ohms at the moment. So what you do is you take your uh, multimeter, set it to volt DC. I'll just place that right there. I'm just taking the small multimeter for this one because it's easier to capture it on camera. Uh, we take our 9 volt battery again. Um, let's first hook up the uh, multimeter positive side to the positive side of the battery and negative side to the negative side of the resistor. There we go. Now let's hook it up and let's see what we can get. So, in previous video, we calculated that the current should be about um, 20 milliamps. So that means that in this video, right now, as soon as I connect this uh, battery, we should end up with 200 millivolts, because 200 millivolts divided by 10, which is the uh, resistor we are going to use, the measurement resistor, and applying Ohm's law, so dividing by 10 should give us 20 milliamps. See, so 200 millivolts, let's go. And there you go. 200 millivolts just like it said it would be say so that's how simple you can measure currents if you for whatever reason don't have a, a current meter on hand can keep in mind with the power rating when using bigger currents but for a small experiment like this you can get away with a one-fourth of a watt resistor so, hope you liked the video make sure to like it if you liked it and subscribe to the channel for more videos and leave a comment down below if you have any questions regarding this. See you guys in the next one.